Hey everybody, my name is Seth, and today we're gonna to be talking about some of our Ray switches that we brought in, in our Smart Series, our Pro Series, and our Max Series. So let's hop on in. Let's first take a look at our Smart Series of switches. Now, think of this series as an entry version of a Layer 2 Managed Switch. And this series, like I said, is managed, allowing for a variety of Managed Switch functions and an easy way to monitor and configure the switch itself. Now, all these switches and all these ports are one gigabyte ports that are PoE plus with an even option to do extended PoE. And the best part being included is a three year warranty. Now this smart series switch consists of four different sizes, a six port, a nine port, a 18 port and a 26 port. Now let's first take a look at the six port, which is 54 Watts. And four of these ports are PoE plus with two uplink ports. The 120 watt nine port has a total of eight PoE plus ports with one uplink port. The 240 watt 18 port has a total of 16 PoE plus ports and two SFP slots. And the 370 watt 26 port has a 24 port PoE plus and two SFP ports. Now with these smart managed switches in this series, they're most ideal for small network infrastructures, meant for small offices, since they have a max of 16 VLANs while still supporting 4KV port surge protection, making this a very cost-effective solution for smaller businesses. Now with the 18 and the 26 port switch, you do get SFP slots, which can actually be used to connect the switch into a fiber network, ultimately increasing the speed of the network. Or if you don't plan on using the SFP slot for fiber networks, you can easily insert the SFP transceiver with an RJ45 interface to still use it as a standard uplink port. The 18 and 26 port switches are also rack mountable. Another way that the smart series switches can be effectively used is through CCTV, where a lot of CCTV technicians still use unmanaged switches on installations. Using unmanaged switches can be limiting and be difficult to troubleshoot situations without being on the actual job site to service the issue at that given moment. Let's dive in and take a look at this example. Let's say that you've installed a 16 channel camera system and your customer gives you a call to let you know that the system is down or maybe just an individual camera is down. The most standard way people uh, go ahead and troubleshoot is going and remoting into the recorder or remoting into the camera. But what if the issue is not on the recorder or not on the camera? Well, then you're gonna have to check cables and the switch to make sure everything's online. Well, using a managed switch instead, you can still troubleshoot that remotely without actually being at the job site like you will with an unmanaged switch. Now we're jumping into the Pro Series switches that we're carrying, and it's a little bit of a bump up from the Smart Series. This switch sits at layer two as well, but with more expanded features and options. For example, this series has a max 4,094 VLANs that you can have, things like ACL support, larger packet buffers, and 6KV of port surge protection per port on this as well. Now these switches in this series are one gigabit ports that are PoE plus as well with extended PoE options on top of that. But one big difference from the Smart Series into the Pro Series is that these switches have a five year warranty. This series consists of a 125 watt eight port switch with eight PoE plus ports and two SFP slots. And it also consists of a rack mountable 370 watt 24 port switch with 24 PoE plus ports and four SFP slots. Now you can use these SFP ports the same way that you would use it on a smart managed switch where you can do SFP port for fiber network or you can use the SFP ports with a SFP transceiver with an RJ45 interface to use that as a standard uplink port to run back into a router. Now, this series is meant for medium-sized network infrastructures where you want more options and more features in the smart series for VLANs and even network management. And even with the benefit that, like I said, it has a five-year warranty. So it's one step up from the smart managed series. Now we're taking a look at the max series switches and these switches have a key difference from the pro series to the smart series. This series offers layer two plus routing functionalities. Now, as an example, when you would want to use the layer two versus layer three plus is when the network access control functions that allow for VLANs to cross communicate specifically amongst other designated VLANs 
This requires either layer three or two plus switches to sit above the layer two switches to coordinate the functions. Now this series consists of a 370 watt 24 port switch with 24 PoE plus ports and four SFP slots. And it also consists of a 740 watt 48 port switch with 40 PoE plus ports and eight PoE plus plus ports, as well as four SFP plus slots to go along with it. Now with the SFP plus slots, you do get higher rates of speed with 10 gigabits rather than a standard SFP port, which is only one. Now, both of these switches are also rack mountable and do come with that five year warranty. Now, last thing with these switches is that it is meant for medium to large size network infrastructures when you need functions that are layer two plus or layer three, where you're gonna need some type of routing capabilities. To wrap this video up guys, we have all these switches and they come in a variety of different options and they're super easy to manage and configure via the web portal or the phone app. And if you wanna see some of that in action, we do have videos on that as well. So thank you guys for watching, catch you later.